I did the uh, the progressions as I started trading when I first started playing. So Sidewinder, Cobra. Then it was, I think, a type six, type seven. I did. I spent ages in a type nine in open, and everyone used to go, "Are you in? A, you do realize you're in open?" But I never had any problems with my type nine until I. Uh, I well, I didn't have any ever have any problems in my type nine. Uh, the only times I started having problems when I uh, switched to my. And I brought an anaconda. Then I got ganked in open. Or people tried, I did a video on it on my channel back in the day. John Potter. And the funny thing about it was I was infuriated. But I now know that some people do play as pirates as a role play thing. And if you play along with it, uh, I guess it would be fun. But. Um, but then there were others just, they were just um, interested in being a pain in the ass. And there was a, a group, I think they were called the Codec or something like that, or the Code. They were just, in my experience, a holes. So, uh, seemed to think that you were just going to touch your toes for them. And if you didn't, they got very indignant about it. Well, I had lots of fun trying to learn how to avoid getting ganked. And the answer was, I got to elite <laughs> and stopped trading. Not because of the gankers, but because um, I was all done. I guess I could link those videos on the screen somewhere. One inter was interesting, I was watching a video on YouTube about um, salvage, because salvage is what I like to do at the moment. Uh, it is varied, takes you all different locations. I was watching this video, but I didn't realize there's now a landing assist for planets. Uh, I didn't think I'd ever use super, I know I'll never use docking assist for space stations. Uh, but I, I guess if I have to use, landing on a planet is a pain. And uh, if the if there's a module to do that, I'm, I'm in. Right, here's a little dot. So the little dot on the left hand side is all I'm looking at. There we go. Down to zero. We should land directly on the pad, maybe a bit back of it. There we go. Oh, good idea. Thank you. Thank you very much, computer. Okay, you're all over the place. So we've got two federations that I'm aligned. Oh, though this is all federation here. So that's what I'm going to try and do is align all those. I'm tempted to do another one of these at some point. So commercial sample salvage. We we'll only do that. That one is cheaper. Oh, that's good. What's that for? Polymers? That's got to be like, the space, the station's got to be about, I would say, 25,000 light seconds. Oh. We'll have some of that then. We'll do that later. There are different levels of threat, but we're not going to. We'll see how it goes. Sometimes the threat is real. So this is 2 million. 196, 90, this is going to be 50 light seconds away from the port, from the sun. 11,000, nothing. Go for that. Do that later. Um, I 
Oh, some nice missions here, eh? Ross 239. 249. Yeah, we do that as well. So now we're just waiting for some. I think if they've got some liquor missions, I'm going to start. Wow. Oh, source and return. Okay, yeah. 688 tons of Bertrandite. That's shouldn't be difficult. And that's two. That's one run in a cutter. <gasps> How long is that mission meant to run? 30 million. It's only 23 hours. Is there a... No, there's no penalty for not doing it. I'll, I'll, I'm going to do that. Right, we'll see how it goes. So, uh, let's have a look. Transactions. That's going to be interesting. Uh, boom time. Bertrandrite was everywhere when I first did... Um, so I just... I would get the clipper and then just go out and try and find Bertrandite. 688 shouldn't be difficult, but times may have changed. So let's go. So we've got to go to there. So that's just quite often you'll find that the uh, star system, is that it? Uh, yeah. Is not scanned yet. So we're going to have to scan that when we get there. So let's go and pick that up. The interface is a little bit, well, I would say a little bit clunkier. It's um, The interface is excellent, uh, but it, it, it's almost designed for touch devices. Let's go to the surface. So uh, we're about 142 million at the moment. I was on 720 million, uh, but I blew 500, 480 million on a bunch of new ships that have been released in the uh, last half decade since I played Elite. And it seems to me like almost all the bugs that mattered to me have so far been fixed. I saw a video today on the hostage recovery missions. I was a little bit surprised because you dropped in, he, the guy dropped into space where there was a, a ship with the hostages. But the ship didn't try and, it just flew about and just let the guy take the hostages. I didn't quite understand that. Right, I'm there. Okay, cool. Right, before I get um, interdicted, let's go and find. Good job I did use, uh, well, the, 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 you know, one of the things I always say in Elite is that you can try all the different ships to do all the different things. At the end of the day, you're going to use a Python. <laughs> so I love the clipper for salvage, but you can't land on these sort of platforms. You know, for these platforms, I think there should be an option that you can offload cargo like in tugs. I've always said that. That would be so cool, you request a tug and it would just come off and uh, take the cargo from your hatch. It would be slow, but you could, slower than landing on the platform, but still um, allow, would, you, would allow you to trade. Like you pick up missions and wait for the cargo to be delivered to your ship. That would be so cool if you could just look out the window and see the cargo on the, like a little tug that comes out, comes out of the service entrance on the platform. Uh, but no. So let's have a look here. This dolphin, no dolphin, broadsword. If, if that, um, there we go. There's a couple of ships there coming in. So this is good because I can just skim around here. They can't attack you um, unless they're behind you. They are behind me. But... They're not behind me anymore. Coming in a bit hot though. Try not to uh, 
There we go. I think I managed to use gravity to my advantage there. There's no aligning. Oh. Oh, hello. All right. Let's have a look. Let's see what they've got to say. Deliver within the next... Uh, oh, okay. Let me uh, get to you quickly then. I should probably... That's good. I was at a port the other day. They kept telling me, no, you can't land. Right, so... I would assume this is it. Nope, that's two. I've never quite worked out how to use the dot at a station, but there it is. Right now we can use the dot. So there we go, it's about right. Get back a bit. Down we go. Oh. Thank you. I did, I, 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 I really thought that um, the viewing deck on a platform would allow me to look out onto the plane. I don't know why. There must be a a GPU thing that stops you from looking out over the planet from uh, space stations. Seems so obvious. Well, that wasn't easy. I don't know how much that was about. 1.3 million. Thank you very much. Like that. Let's have a look at the missions. Alrai, uh, 54. No. Okay, well, at least we'll be lighter. I always make a habit now of never launching. I always uh, just go back upside. Right, so we're going back to... Oh no, I've got to go back to... What I need to do is find Wolf 54. Is it in here? I it seemed to think it was. There it is, yeah. There we go. So is... So poo or whatever it's called in here. Because this is all the, the sort of space I was in before. There we go. All right, we're going to make that. Let's just get back. Go. Launch. So, I'm um, not sure. Ooh. So, it'll be interesting we do get interdicted for a mission that we've already handed in. I think I've had that happen. And, like, right outside, you know, abort. So, I dropped off a mission at a destination and then was going back to pick up another mission and got interdicted as I was coming in to literally drop into bounds. Well, it's not going to be this asp. If it is, I'd be very happy. I've done it again, haven't I? Sort of switched off. Right, I trying to do a better job of using the planet this time without hitting it. that he got up to. If the eagle interdicts me, that'll be fine. So, once you're inside the seven and a half, if someone flies into you while you're doing over 100, you're done for. It seems a bit tedious to me. But I think if they crash and blow up is the thing. I could just drop the speed and it went back up again. God, this is like two, driving in a 20 mile an hour zone. Landing complete. Engines disengaged. 
Mission board. Mission. So what I should do is uh, show you around the ship. Polymers, yep. Okay. Transactions. Polymers. Here we go. LFT90. I have been there recently. Do some salvage. Nice. I like that. Refinery Industrial. Let's uh, select this. I'm going to have to find some Bertrandite and lots of it. That'd be fun, sort of. Well, depends where this station is, what side of the rings, and I think it's this side of the ring, or it's going to be on the planet. That'd be pretty cool. I don't think it is, is it? Uh, oh, here we go. Here comes somebody. Dwayne. Better get your ice in gear, mate, then. Oh, here's Dwayne. Uh, here's Elite. Let's switch out of that. Let's get to the weapons. I'm going super slow, mate. If you want to hurry up and interdict me. If he does latch, if he does a hatch breaker, that would be quite annoying. Good thing about being so close to the station, uh, the station being so close to the sun. Oh. Hey, how you doing? Oh, wrong target. Oh. I wasn't in a no via zone. Oh, never mind. Update hundred pound. Wow, I got lots of. Did I get like a hundred pound fine for every bullet I fired? Let's hope I don't uh, get shot as I go in. I wasn't within. I wasn't mass locked. We'll soon find out. That'll be annoying. Uh, request docking. Okay, I need to pay those fines off. Uh, okay, I thought I was. See, look. Just took my hand off the joystick for a moment then. So pad 11. That was um, that was quite clever actually then of that Cobra contacts. Administrative contact. Pay off your 7,000 fine for each bullet. 2,000. Okay. I must have fired 20 bullets. <laughs> Blood brothers of our eye. Always good to do business, boys and girls. So back to Wolf 54. Is there anything here for me? I'm looking at missions purely because uh, we're so close to the star here. Yeah, we'll do that. 142 units. So that's basically a mission to go back to where we're going. I like that. Yeah, 132. Nice. So there's a lot of well-paid missions at the moment. They do come and go. So what I need to do is go to bookmarks, select, manage, and go to systems, and go to 
Sopa, whatever it's called. And make it a favourite. Have I got the teller? No, but I'm going to make this... Add this system as well. I've got to come back here anyway, so I can do it later. Okay, let's go. Oh, was I still on? I thought I'd... Never mind. So that's the cruise ship. Coming in behind me. I need to be aware of that, because if he crashes into me, I should be done for. Cardinal Tower. Oh, okay. Shall we drop off this? This is a good little run I got going here. Thank you very much. Now I pick up this here. Ah, uh, don't, get on. Right, delivery of superconductors. This is the port. It should be pretty close. It is close. It's good. I haven't got Super Cruise Assist. I'm actually um, quite sold on Super Cruise Assist. This will be the three million job one, is it? Two million. Aha. Uh -huh. Right, okay. So I've got the car going. Hold. <sighs> Challenger. Right, let's uh, get rid of that mode. Switch into combat mode. Now what I should do, if I want to avoid this, and I'm going to try and avoid it. He's catching me up though, isn't he? That's a big star system, isn't it? So we're going to try and do, we're going to come down underneath it, rotate in, try and minimize the uh, impact. But he's going to, he's going to get me soon. Before I get there, in fact, that isn't going to bind you, it's going to force me. There we go. So if I get a hatch, latch, hatch. See what he does. Oh, he's straight into it. Okay. Cool. That's the only thing about the uh, the um, Python. Right. Thank you, yes. Oh, we've got some feds. Good. That's what I like to see. So that's good. So he actually has not... I'm not doing a particularly good job of coming around on him. Right, so we can try and stay on him. I like the Chieftains are lovely. Ah, uh, don't you go anywhere, mate. Got him. He is gone. Nice. That was good. 
I thought the plasma worked quite well there, actually. You sort of helped take, take down, help take down his shields. I, I wasn't really aware of what sort of damage I was doing. I was just aware of trying to stay on him and try and get position, which is really difficult to do in a python with 200 tons of cargo. See, so yeah, I'm going to hit gravity there. Now, if you had a platform circling so close to a planet, you think there would be a viewing deck, wouldn't you? I'd like to stay in the um, analysis mode because it means you don't accidentally fire. Uh, that was denied, wasn't it? While I'm waiting then, I'm going to do the uh, control for the uh, chaff. You mean denied? I'm an ally. I want priority. Thank you. That's pretty cool, actually. You've got to wait. Come on. Up you come. Up you go. Come on. Up you go. Up, up. There. There we go. Okay, so what I was going to do the other day is... That was the one. Here we go. Here we go. Let's see if we can write off another ship on the other platform. See, the interesting thing is I can't really see the dot, which is what I'm using to do this. Landing gear is down, I can see that. There we go, I've still got me a combat suit on. I think I'm a little bit skewed. Hey. Oh, who the man? Who the man? That's a great screenshot. You guys here, I don't suppose you've got 600 tons of um, merchandise, have you? Or have I, have I collected that mission? I do that. I've been doing that a lot. Right. Have you got 600 tons of merchandise? Filters. Uh... What is? Right, so it's a mineral, okay. Galactic average for what? Search market? What, search for what? Merchandise? Yeah, we want to sell. We want to buy. Okay, well, that was interesting. Right, any missions for Wolf 54? No. Yeah, your perspective's a little bit off. There we go. What happened to the view? There we go. So, where's the uh, view that I like? Okay, so it's there. That's number three. That view. Oh, that. Okay. Oh, okay, that's. 
backwards and forwards. That's number three. That's pretty cool, eh? Right, what other missions we have remaining? It's just that one Bertrand died, 31 million. <laughs> okay. Uh, so we don't have any. They want minerals. We ain't got no minerals here. Let's have a look at the galaxy map. What you want is something that says, here is the closest place you can find. Um... Minerals. Ah. I think I've seen some there, yeah. Al Rai. There. High tech and refinery. Market information. So they want it. Yeah. So if it was, is it, would it be green? There. Export zero, they've got none. <laughs> Al Rai, zero, zero, zero. So they'll import it, but... So, um, what are we saying? Ah. So, Rakutino High. That's not far away. Let me just go and have a look there then. It'd be interesting to see whether. So I don't know whether it's expecting me to go and mine it. Three jumps. Can't complain of that. I know what will happen. I'll get there. And they'll have like 30 units for sale. So there's no fuel at this next station, but... uh. I've only got two jumps left. So we find out the nearest port is uh, 51,000 light seconds away. Be interesting to see how that map works out. I remember when uh, the game was in alpha. I, mean, uh, was, I never played alpha. I did play a camera. And there was Bertrand Day everywhere. But when the game actually went live, I do remember now. There was hardly any Bertrandite. Oh well, we'll see. So no, we are pretty close, I think. No, we're not. Here we are. So what is this? Ragatino High. What's it got selected for me? I've got everything filtered out, haven't I? So I wonder... So that's the place that it indicated. So we'll have a look here anyway, see where we go, and then we may have to go somewhere else. Nothing seemed too odiously distant away.
So we came right in behind. Thank you kindly. How much Bertrandite can you sell me? Huh? Thank you. Righty ho. What would be nice if you had like 32,000 tons of Bertrandite? I will do, thank you very much. I don't see any large vessels right now, but if I do, I will be sure to make way. Scan detected. 26th is right below me. Gear up. I'm going to be very disappointed, aren't I? I'm going to land here. And the great Frontier XL spreadsheet of mineral trading is going to dictate that 30 million would not be that easy. Landing complete. Ship secured. Great. Cool. I'm coming back here. So that's three million. So it's going to cost me nine million to buy the lot ish. Cargo hold at maximum capacity. Right, okay. Now, where am I taking this? Landing gear retracted. Busy system. No real life players. Which is always assuring. I'm sorry, sir, you're not allowed to buy a bird and die from this part and take it outside the premises. So the, the idea is get back to Salpa, whatever it's called, Salpa, Matt. Three, two, Drop off this first load of cargo and then transport the cutter into Salpa Mat and then do the next, the last final pickup in one. So there was more than enough for what we needed. So I wonder how, um, looking at that galaxy map, I wonder how uh, the notice of what systems have which is populated? Do you have to have gone there? Do you buy the data? Well, I didn't, I haven't brought any data. So is it just transmitted around the system as you'd expect, like a stock market thing? If this pans out how it seems to pan out, it is going to be one of the most satisfying um, experiences I've had in Elite. That's how it should work. But you never know. Elite has always got a few surprises in store. Not worried, not worried. Ferdinand, that's a hauler, okay. That's a clipper. Where is he? Straight in front of me. It might be a problem. 
I don't think so, because he's... Mind you, he's about to get in behind me, isn't he? I'll worry about him when it happens. So I'm about to spin around here anyway. There we go. I don't have anyone behind me at the moment. I do now, though. Come on. Come on. No, they're not going to tick me, are they? No. Ah. Uh, the reason I'm submitting is now the only trouble is. Right, get rid of that. Get rid of that. Now I know. Ouch. Missed him. Now this ship is fairly sturdy. I haven't selected him yet though, there we go. Now he is a bit better than... The ship is faster than me, so he can outrun me without any issues. So I'm at 96 at the moment, not too much to worry about, but I should have done a better job there. Oh, feds are in, feds are in the house. So I don't have to outrun him. Right, let's get the shields charged. Oh, I, that's nice. You ain't going nowhere, mate. Oh, I missed him, though. But I say he's not going anywhere. He's not going anywhere. That was... sweet. The great thing about uh, flying a clipper, as you know, the shields are a struggle to maintain, but it's a great benefit of its manoeuvrability. Now, if those allies hadn't turned up, I would have been in trouble. I think, I don't know whether I've got any alloys or but, uh, um, but I think the feds managed to distract it enough that uh, I managed to get some good plasma shots in on it and took its shields out. I don't think it would have ended up like that if the allies hadn't turned up. I haven't got a shield bank on this because of the Cargo needs. It's nice that I'm protected here as well. Right, the first thing we need to do is shipyard. Manage ships. I never feel very good about the fact that uh, um, use the ship and buy the ship are right next to each other. Mission board. Anyone 
any other Bertram Dyke missions. <laughs> uh, I'm going to do that one because I can. I've got space. Thirteen million for eighty-one units. Right, let's go and top up our go, go to the back of the ship and top up our drinks. Right, shipyard. Imperial Cutter. Use this ship. So I've got, uh, I think I've now got about 400, maybe 500 tons of capacity in here. 700. Cool. Okay, no shields. Um, Staple services. I think that's what I was about to do. This is probably not going to have much in the way of super crews and stuff like that. I don't know what AFMs are. What are they? Oh, maintenance modules. Shell cell bank. Cargo capacity 776. Yeah. Uh, if I drop 64, if I drop 256, it's going to just give me over 500. Getting greedy, partner. You get greedy. Drop that into storage. Oh, some military compartment. Can't do anything but our Oh, this is quite a well specced. 15 million? We've got two of them. <laughs> Arr. Why are these two shield generators? Ah, oh, that's modded, is it? Okay. That seems like a good upgrade. I'm not sure what happens when the uh, the thingy arrives. I'm not sure about this either. So, um, multi cannon. I think I'd be more inclined to put it like a. Oh, they have plasma accelerator. I like the idea of the transit. To be honest, even though. It's slowing me down. And then I'm just going to put everything else as... I found that multi-cannons is just the way forward. Also, it's like it's, you know, too many things to drain. Uh, multi-cannon turrets, I think. Yeah, they're at the back there. Just purely to be... Laying down fire while uh, all we're doing really is we've got a ship set up purely to um, to give us time. That's what it's about. So I wonder what the uh, I love that. So my shield. I'm interested to see what happens when it arrives. So core internal. No. Okay. Optional internal. Shield generators, four minutes. Right, so the shield is here. So I guess I can go to here. So the cargo rack hasn't been updated. So I just need to go to here. Place module. Cool, okay. And go to C, 712, fuel capacity 64. So, I have no idea what, what that does. Shield booster, I know what that does. 
And what are we like on our right on the edge of power? Electronic missiles and torpedoes. Do I have to fire it? Yeah, I guess so. So we've got a shield booster, heat sink, heat sink, chaff. Uh, I think that should be enough. Cool. Okay. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go to, going to go to there, bookmarks. And we're going to, bruh. And it's that close that we won't even need to. This is exciting. <laughs> right, so we are off to pick up 700. Well, I don't think I need. Yeah, I am going to pick up 700 tons of burr tonight because anything I don't use for missions, I can sell. Into Aster is a very cool addition. There's so many things that are cool about this game. So I haven't got any cargo at the moment, so I shouldn't be offending anybody. Fire groups. So this is how I had the Python set up. Oh, I've taken off without the... Uh, <laughs> without the uh, plasma. D-scanner 2. I'm not going to fire the heat sink. I have no idea what an ECM is. Like electro something, I guess. So, yeah, I've got chaff. Let's go. Temperature is hot. Nice for sure. It's getting a little bit steamy in here. So, 700 tons is going to cost me probably about. 10 million but I should make 20 million on that so the good thing is I'm transporting it to a federation system uh, this Burton date so even if I get interdicted I feel safe so I'm gonna have to try and that's not gonna slow me down enough is it So crate is uh, like a small python. I'm not, I don't know whether it's more maneuverable. It didn't feel like it, but it's like a spec down python. Right, come on, let's go. Drop me now. So this actually sounds. Uh, this ship actually sounds a lot faster than it actually is, unless I've got underrated or underspecified modules in here, which is quite possible. Right, can I, would it be unwise for me to do this? Oh, I'm not quite sure what was going on there. Oh, well the chaff works. Oh, good job I was going slow. Okay, so that is, so I need to slow down, I need to turn around. So the landing pad is right underneath me. There it is, 24. It's got a couple of loose tiles. Now this is a little bit ambitious, I have to say. There we go. So we're at zero speed. We should be right above it. Um, okay. I'm sorry, sir. We have sold out of Burton Diet. Please come back another day. That? Burton Diet. 
supply is dropping. Uh, there we go. Who cares? Right, so this is 12 millions worth of cargo. I've already spent 4 million, so we're looking at 16, say 17 million by... So I am not going to be uh, doing any camera work with 700 tons a hold. Half a kilometer just to get to the pad below me. Hoorah! Okay, Starport Services, let's get it on. Landing complete. Engines disengaged. So, 31 million. Deliver. Wow, okay, so it took the whole hold. Seems a little bit of a coincidence that, uh, I've got 222 left, okay. That's what I thought. Stop services, mission board. Eighty one units to deliver. I almost certainly wouldn't have enough for this, will I? <laughs> I have. Cool, so so far tonight I've made 40 million. That's nice. And I've had great fun doing it. 38 tons left. No more missions, so let's exit there and go to the commodities market. I brought them for 1,700 some odd. So. Sell. Minerals, yeah, I should probably make about a thousand per Nice, that was good, enjoyed that <laughs> I had 38 tons and there's 36 tons for 3 million Hilarious Hilarious It was probably there, I probably missed it. 22 million. Or 54, 3.
I've got a lot of work to do there. I can do that. All right, let's do another run then. We know that we can make money regardless. 